my own view is that we are in a creation and that creation is, as we would say amongst uh, philosophers, ex nihilo, that is out of nothing. And I would also go further than that, which is within, I believe, at least Christian orthodoxy, that God sustains the world continuously. If impossibly he was metaphorically to take his mind off things, we wouldn't be here. We are genuinely created. But if I look at the natural world, I see that it's very highly ordered. I see that amongst other things, it allows consciousness to emerge. And I see also that not only does it allow consciousness, but it allows people to understand things, to understand rational things, to understand logic, to understand mathematics, to create things themselves, as Tolkien would have said, to act as sub-creators. And all of that I regard as being consistent with the existence of God. They're not knockdown arguments, they're not absolute proofs, because in another theological way, the majority of believers would say that fundamentally God is entirely unknowable. He's not us, with one perhaps critical exception.